How we going guys? Mad Mini Vlogger here and that's right, we're back. Yeah baby. Why well, I'm still looking over here. Oh, I still haven't done it, use a camera. So as you can see in the background, there's a ruby. There's what we've been doing. I'll explain that in a second. Um but yeah, so we haven't been around for a while. Um it's been a bit up and down recently, really. Uh, I've had lots of stuff going. I need to stop moving, so I'm just gonna stand here. So we uh, lots of stuff going on, lots of stuff. Uh, in my life that's been going on, I've been training for a new career and so on and so forth um, But we're back. We've got another guy who's working with me uh, To get this done. Hopefully we'll be at London to Brighton. Uh, if not London to Brighton, we'll try and be at IMM uh, If not IMM, shit, we'll see you around. <laughs> um, but let's walk you through what we're doing for Rubes. See you in a sec Okay, so this is a uh... Ruby, <laughs> um, as you can see, one side of it has no lights, the other side has lights. Uh, there's a mess, bird's nest of wiring there. Um, all the the engine's been taken apart and uh, stripped and uh, then thrown in a bin and this engine put in. So this is a different engine. Um, we have got lots and lots of stuff on here that we need to do. Um, but this will all be coming in videos over the coming months. Um, well, weeks or however many it is. The first thing we're going to do uh, is we're just going to walk through a few bits that we found uh, as we were digging through this. Now, as some of you know, the story back the story behind uh, Ruby is that uh, I had a really bad accident. I bought this car as a um, sort of like a pick me up. Well done for doing so well with my recovery and learning to use my arms and legs and stuff again and all that sort of shit uh, without getting too sentimental into it. So I bought this from a guy. And it was supposed to be fully restored. Uh, it turns out he's just a tosser. Uh, and this, this car's a death trap. So I'll give you an indication. So this is obviously our lovely panel. Which isn't actually attached to anything. Uh, as you can see, it's not even welded on. Uh, that is completely... I don't know if I can do it in one hand. Cause it's not the strongest of hands. but uh, No. But uh, either which way. I mean, you can probably see. It's not attached anywhere on the car except for here which is loads of tiger seal uh the front end member here uh is bent uh these were where the spotlights were the thing is is this so surprise uh this is coming off and we've got a fiberglass flip front yeah flip front put my teeth in <laughs> flip front to go in uh which is sat over there which i'll show you in a little while probably in the next couple of videos but uh all of this is coming off, and that's what we're doing today. So today I'm getting the grinder out, uh, and we're cutting off a flip front and getting it all done. So, yeah, buddy. Yeah, well, that's that's basically all we're doing. So <laughs> I don't know what the pause was for there. Uh, but, yeah, anyway, it's been really good to, to be back and, and doing videos with you guys again. And uh, I've missed you guys. So let's get on. Hopefully at least, uh, the phone stays here. <laughs> so yeah, as, as you probably guessed, I haven't started really doing much. Uh, so all I'm going to do, I'm just going to remove some of the bits. Yeah, this is probably going to be a montage. So you're not going to hear me talking. So it's going to be good. looking at this and going, hey, Pete, guess what? You still haven't got a clue what you're doing. You're right. Absolutely, 100%. I have no idea what I'm doing. But, well, that's how we learn. And what the hell is this? I think we might need a new cutting disc. <laughs> Good times. Uh, put a new disc on that, shall 
There it goes. There you go. So, yeah, as expected, it fell off. Uh, however, it's completely fine, which is bizarre because I dropped on carpet and it broke. Anyway, new discs on. Let's get on the dirt. Okay. Let's... Judge of things, that is not a very big spanner. Uh, what do you reckon? Eight mil? Eight mil? Sorry, I may be here a while. I'll bring you back. So I'll tell you what I'm going to do guys, I'm going to get this panel off and then I'll bring you back. Let's do that. Save you sitting around just watching me undo bolts that you can't actually see because they're down here. Bear with me. So here we are. This is where we're at. One end of it is off. This bit here. This is the next one. You see I did start ahead and I thought, oh shit, I'm meant to be recording this. Um, however, <laughs> never trust a Yorkshireman. That is a scuttle panel. Uh, that that was me. Ignore that. That was definitely me. However, it's just been welded over the top of. You can probably hear all that falling out. Rust. So, I think what we're going to have to do. I want this car to be safe, um, and I want this car to be good. Um, I want this to be a forever car. So. I think what we're going to do, I'm going to speak to my mechanic, but I think we'll take all this off and uh, rebuild from the start from forwards back, you know, from back to front uh, and see where we go. I know the rear is solid. I know all of that's good um, because we had that done already. Um, the A panel, <laughs> the A panel was funny, actually. I'll explain over this side. Want to see something really awesome and safe? Check this out. <laughs> Where it's still here. So this A panel here isn't welded in. I'm going to guess because that one wasn't. So there's the, obviously you've got the clips underneath here. That's all that's holding that in. And the pressure of this, ignore that. And the pressure of this uh, wheel arch with the tiger seal pushing that against the body. So uh, we'll see. See you in a bit. All right, guys, well, this is where we've got to so far. So two panels this side and this side are off. Hell yeah. And uh, that's my finger, hello. Um, bottom bit needs to come off. Just need to uh, get that sorted. And uh, we'll come back to you. Bear with me a moment. We'll bring you back into the action. <laughs> uh, so yeah, this is it. Should now be coming off.
unfortunately the guy that I bought it from was a bit of a muppet. I know you can't see much, uh, but it's down here, so behind here, the bracket here. He welded it on to the... Uh, Point where I'm unable, sadly, to uh, get it off without cutting it. I think. I mean, I'm going to give this another go. Just bear with me. Oh. I bet you're all sitting there pissing yourselves laughing. <sighs> I know I would be. Uh, let's have a look, see what it is. What do we reckon? What are we saying, guys? What size? Um, 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 oh. I'm getting torn from this shit. It's off. Salted. Now I'm naked. I need a pint. Oh. Oh right. Well, that is the uh, front end off. Let me take you off the stand here and uh, show you. There we go. Front ends off. So this was the main problem areas, but this was all filler. Um, and it sounds like there's more filler up underneath there. He's used uh, cheap paint. Uh, these are looking a bit knackered. So I think these are gonna have to be replaced too. Um, this side, this definitely needs a new scuttle because I, I kind of chopped through that. Um, we'll, we'll ignore that bit. So. We'll, yeah, there we go. Um, yeah, but otherwise, I'd say it's been a pretty successful morning. Uh, the fact that the front end is now off. Sorted. Well, bear with me and I'll bring you back. Oh, well, guys, that's it. First redo of... I've just put muck all over my forehead. What a prat. Now I've got to go out with dirt all over my face. Oh, fuck it. Um, so, first remake of Ruby Mark II. There she is. Um, so Ruby Mark 2, she's been done, um, yeah really, I can't really say much more, where am I going? I can't really say much more, um, yeah, to be honest with you, it's been a hell of a roller coaster with this car, um, but I've decided that I am going to keep it, we are going to make it look better, and I'm going to be doing it myself, 
Um, it's not going to be perfect, but it's going to be a damn sight better than it was. Uh, but cheers for joining us, guys. Next episode, you're going to meet Terry uh, from Rosa Sport Minis, uh, who's very kindly offered to help me um, fix Ruby, basically, and get it up and running and rocking and rolling. And oh, I keep looking over here. What is over here? There's a hat. Oh, yeah, the hat. I almost forgot. There we go. There we are. <laughs> Uh, Mad Old Mini's Facebook page, of course, uh, supporting the channel. Um, if you haven't seen it, go on Facebook.com and it's Mad Old Minis. Come join us. Good little community where you'll find everything you need to know about these wonderful little motors. Okay, I think we're going to read it there. Cheers, guys, for watching. Um, apologies for video quality again, as always. Uh, it's been dross. There we are. Look at that. Look, I'll get a better light this way. Um, yeah, cheers. And I'll see you next time. See you later.